Good day everyone. So welcome again sa ating math classroom with your teacher, Teacher Dan. For today's video, ang pag-aaralan natin ay surface area of a cylinder. So ang surface area natin, that is the total area around your uh, solid figure. Okay? So para mahanap natin yan, gagamit tayo ng tatlong formula dito. Una, Nagamitin natin ang formula ng area of a circle, which is pi r squared. So, ito ay circle. So, gagamit tayo dyan ang formula ng pi r squared. Ganon din dito, gagamit tayo dyan ang area is pi r squared. Next natin, gagamitin ay ang ating circumference which is diameter times pi. So, ito yung ating diameter. Paikot dyan. Simula dito. Punta doon. Paikot. Paikot, no? Para mahanap natin ang habang ito. Simula dito. Hagan dito. Ang tawag natin dyan is circumference. Paikot. Okay? So, ang last natin gagamitin ay ang area ng ating Rectangle na length times the width. So, yan ang tatlong gagamitin natin formula para mahanap natin ang surface area ng isang cylinder. So, simulan natin sa paghahanap ng area ng ating circle. So, ang ating circle ay merong radius na 4. So, area of the circle, ang formula natin is Area is pi r squared. Ibig sabihin, ang pi natin is 3.14 times 4 times 4. So, 4 times 4, that is 16. So, 3.14 times 16. So, 6 times 4, that is 24. Okay, with 2, 6 times 1, 6 plus 2. That is 8. 6 times 3, that is 18. And then, we have 1 times 4. That is 4. 1 times 1, 1, and then 3. Add natin, para mahanap natin ang product niya, we have 4, 12, carry 1. So, that is 10, carry 1, and then 5. We have two decimal place, two decimal place then ng ating product. So, ito yung ating area ng ating isang circle. Okay? So, ito ay 50.24. So, area to that is meter square. Ito din, 50.24 meter square. Next natin, hahanapin natin itong circumference. Ito, given ito, yung height natin, that is 10 meter. So, ito yung hahanapin natin, yung circumference. So, circumference is equal to diameter times ating pi. Ang diameter natin dito is 4, tapos sa pang dere-derecho dito, 4. So, 4 and 4, that is 8. So, 3.14 times 8. So, 8 times 4, that is 32. Carry 3. 8 times 1 plus 3, that is 11. Carry 1. 8 times 3, that is 24 plus 1, 25. So, to decimal place. So, ang ating circumference dito is 25.12 So, this is our conference. So, lagay lang natin meter. Okay. So, ito yun. So, that is, this is 25.12 meter. Tapos, gagamitin na natin ang formula na length times width para mahanap natin ang area ng ating rectangle. So, so, ang area ng rectangle is length times width. Ang length natin dito is 
0.12 times ang ating width na 10, ang ating height. So, multiplying that, ang answer natin, that is 251.2. That is the area of our like rectangle, 251.2. Adding all the area natin, we have dalawang, ano, dalawang uh, circle that is area or the surface area of our cylinder is 50.24, another 50.24, at ang ating rectangle na may area na 251.2. So, add natin, we have 8, 6, we have 1, 15, carry 1, it's 3. So, ang ating surface area ng ating uh, cylinders, example number 1, it's 351.68. So, this is meter square. So, that is our final answer. For question number 1. So, ganun lang. Ginamit natin ang formula ng area ng circle, circumference ng circle, at ang area ng isang rectangle para mahanap natin ang total surface area ng ating cylinder. Let's have another example, number 2. Okay, ganun pa rin. Gagamit tayo ng formula ng area na ating uh, uh, circle which is pi r squared at gagamit din tayo ng formula ng ating circumference which is diameter times your pi at gagamit din tayo ng area ng rectangle na length times ating width okay simula natin dito sa example number 2 natin una natin hanapin na ang area ng ating circle na gagamit ng formula pi r squared so ang ating pi it's given 3.14 times ang ating radius dito it's 5 times 5 okay so, we have 5 times 5, that is 25. So, 3.14 times 25. 5 times 4, that is 20, give it 2. 5 times 1, that is 5 plus 2, that is 7. 5 times 3, it is 15. Then, next natin, 2 naman ang gamitin natin. 2 times 4, that is 8. 2 times 1, that is 2. 2 times 3, that is 6. And then, add natin, we have 0, 15, carry 1, that is 8, and then 7. Okay? Tapos 2 decimal place, 2 decimal place. So, ating area dito, it's 78.5 inches square. So, area kasi kaya may square. Next natin, so ito ay 78.5. Ito naman ay 78.5. Next natin, ang ating circumference. Simula dito hanggang doon. Okay? So, circumference natin ay diameter times 5. Ang diameter natin dito, that is 5. At another 5, so that is 10. So, 3.14 times 10. Move lang tayo ng decimal place, magiging 31.4. That is the circumference natin dito. So, this is the length ng ating rectangle, 31.4. Okay, and then hanapin naman natin ang area ng ating rectangle na length time sweet so dito ang ating uh, formula ay length time sweet ang length natin dito is 31.4 times ang ating width na 9 okay so 9 ito so times 9 so that is 9 
times 4, 36. Carry 3, 9 times 1, 9 plus 3, that is 12. Carry 1, 9 times 3, 27 plus 1, is 28. So, 1 decimal, this is 1 decimal. So, ang ating uh, area ng ating rectangle is 282.6 inches square. Okay, so add na natin. So ito ay 282.6. This is the area nito. Okay. Add na natin. So that is surface area. We have circle 1, circle 2, dalawang circle. So 28.5, another 78.5 plus ating rectangle na 282.6. Adding that, so that is 16, carry 1, 9, plus 8, 17, plus 2, 19. 19, carry 1, so that is 15, plus 8, 23, carry 2, that is 4. So, ating surface area ng ating example number 2 na cylinder is 439. 0.6, lalagyan natin ng inches, so surface area squared. So that is the surface area ng ating example number 2 sa ating cylinder. Okay? So gagamit lang tayo ng formula na tatlo sa finding the area of a circle, and then finding the circumference, and then finding the the area ng ating rectangle and making the total of the three area, the two circle and a rectangle, you have your surface area of your cylinder. Thank you for listening. Have a good day.